okay now I'm going to teach you or show you how to create hyperlinks in a website in a web page okay what are hyperlinks hyperlinks are actually words or images that when you click on it you'll go somewhere else maybe another website another page maybe you can open some softwares okay so I'm very sure that you have seen it um, already online uh, usually it is blue color by default and there will be an underline below it okay so I'm going to show you uh, a few ways that we can accomplish this okay first thing we are going to try with uh, a normal text-based uh, hyperlink okay here I have one paragraph uh, whereby I want to click MMU so that I can go to MMU's web page okay so what I can do is I can actually put the anchor tag alright the anchor tag is actually A alright this is how you create hyperlinks depending on uh, which uh, word that you want to click so you have in front of it A and at the back of it you close your A this is the anchor tag inside the anchor tag you need to specify where you want to go the URL so for that you need to have href the reference and place MMU's um, URL the website URL at this particular location so if I'm not mistaken it is HTTP www.mmu.edu.my okay so let's see what happens refresh this and now you see this is the hyperlink so when your mouse goes over that particular word right automatically it will be a pointer all right from an arrow it becomes a pointer and you can actually click on it so if you click on it okay because currently i'm not online um, I am not able to display the web page but it is actually at that particular location if you look at the uh, tab over here we are actually there alright so let's go back did you notice something that it is actually using the same uh, tab to display that website alright from your page it is converted to MMU's web page alright what if you don't want this to happen uh, you want this page to be as it is but you want to open this particular link in another tab or another window you have one choice you can put target target equals to underscore blank very simple okay I'm going to put it in the next line so that you can see the whole thing together very simple just include target underscore blank okay let's see the effect okay here MMU click on it okay can you see a difference your page is still here side by side but it is opening that particular link in a new page okay so this is one way that you can link to a website what if you want to link to another page not a website okay another page like for example now I am at lesson 5 so this is my lesson 5 I want to link it to lesson 1 alright this is lesson 1 eh? so very simple again I put A and I want lesson 1 to be clickable eh? so I put it right at the end and my reference point will be that particular page so sorry uh, lesson one and don't forget your uh, extension as well okay so lesson one and I will put everything here save this let me minimize this okay refresh so this is 
clickable all right so click on it and you'll see lesson one again it is displayed in the same tab if you don't like it you can put target blank somewhere around here so it's up to you okay so you have MMU you have uh, linking to a website uh, you have linking to another page okay what if I want to link to another software example I want to write an email so I want that particular link to be connected to the email software that I have in my PC so for example I have something like this I want the word write to be clickable alright so I want the effect to be something like save this uh, okay refresh Okay, let me continue with the uh, okay, let me close this okay refresh okay now okay I have this this is clickable now all right um, but I don't want to open a website page or a normal web page I want it to trigger an email software okay so you can use mail too mail to colon colon is uh, the symbol that you have like dot on top and dot at the bottom and maybe you can have contact at gmail dot com so you can have something like this make sure you don't have any spacing here you don't need any spacing over here make sure there's no space okay so when you save this the effect will be slightly different okay so let's see the effect right click on it so it will trigger the software the email software that I have in my PC so this is what is going to happen it is not a web page it is not a website it is a software alright so once I have uh, uh, linked to this particular software straight away I can write an email and the email will go to this particular okay let me cancel this off yes okay that email will go straight to this particular address straight away so you don't have to retype the address again okay so this one is for linking to websites this one is linking to pages within your folder this one is to link to an email software so that it makes your email writing much more easier and faster and the last one will be uh, your your hyperlinks right it doesn't have to be words only it can also be an image so earlier in our previous lesson you know already how to insert images into a web page so now I have the image ready but how do I change it to become a hyperlink very simple just put the anchor tag in front and close the anchor tag behind and just make sure you write where you want to go meaning your reference point okay so maybe you can go to lesson dot html all right so save this okay let me push it to another line so that you can see everything all right so now the image is clickable just now the word was clickable so now because the image is in this location so i can click on the image now so let me save this refresh and can you see the pointer and if I click on it, I'll go to lesson 2. If I go back, it'll come back to the current lesson. 
and again if you want it to open to another open in another tab or window you can use target underscore blank 